diagnostic uh, 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 diagnostic uh, how to run diagnostic test uh, in fixed model uh, firstly we are going to use uh, uh, PSRN cross-sectional uh, dependence test so this is the command for checking cross-sectional uh, dependence in fixed effect model so what is the p-value p-value is more than five percent this means uh, there is no cross-sectional dependence there is no cross-sectional uh, dependence uh, in this uh, data because uh, no cross-sectional dependence yeah sorry uh, dependence there is no cross-sectional uh, dependence in this data set because the p-value is more than five percent so it is independent now what is the next test so this is test for serial correlation so this is xt serial is the command and roa is my dependent variable and all these are my independent variables so for checking serial correlation voltage test for uh, serial correlation or auto correlation in panel data so this is the result and the result says that uh, there is uh, serial correlation or auto, auto correlation in this uh, data because the p-value uh, is more than uh, sorry is less than uh, five percent so the null hypothesis of no first order correlation auto correlation uh, is rejected so the alternative hypothesis of uh, 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 first order correl auto correlation is accepted here the next test uh, is to to check for group wise heteroelasticity in this uh, data set but before uh, this uh, uh, what we do that we write xt test uh, xt test 3 to check uh, uh, for uh, to check for uh, uh, hetero group by hetero elasticity so again uh, this is a modified ball test for group wise hetero elasticity and uh, here the test uh, result uh, if you see test result uh, the uh, p value is less than five percent this means this uh, data set suffers from group wise it it was elasticity so so there is uh, two problem there are two problems in this model uh, first uh, there is a first order uh, auto correlation uh, there is uh, auto correlation and uh, and and here we also have uh, group wide group wise heteroskedasticity in this model so this model can't be used because we cannot use this model we cannot use this model we have to use some other model for example FGLS uh, model uh, is appropriate uh, in this model so what we do that we uh, you we are going to use uh, FGLS model here FGLS model but before this we again write to we have to write uh, this command in order to declare this data set to be panel data and then we write xtgls so so now you see that this data set has 
no hit elasticity and there is no first order auto correlation so this model does not suffer from does not suffer from uh, any of these two so fgls can be used by writing this command so this is the diagnostic uh, in such type of uh, problems